The question of who is a Singaporean writer, which we asked in an earlier lecture, also arises with the playwrights. Of the five playwrights of an earlier generation, only Robert Yeo was born in Singapore. But they all spent the major part of their lives in Singapore, so the question of whether they are Singapore writers may not arise. Coe's case, however, as we'll discover later, is not so straightforward. The difficulties of deciding who is a Singaporean playwright and what is Singapore drama continue. Huzair Sulaiman, for example, is often regarded as a Malaysian author and hence is a writer of Malaysian literature. But he has now spent a good part of his creative life in Singapore. As Huzair's position in the Singaporean theatrical scene becomes more entrenched, it will be even more difficult to dissociate him from Singapore theatre and drama, and it will in fact become more valid to describe him as a Singapore playwright. I have noted, for example, in my forthcoming bibliography for Malaysian Singapore Literature in English for the year 2015, that the theatre practitioner Jose Sulaiman is now based in Singapore and quite often regarded as a Singaporean playwright, as seen in Cory Tan's analysis of Jose's play Atomic Jaya in the Straits Times as a Singaporean play, in spite of its obvious Malaysian contexts. <laughs> Thank you.